Welcome back to the World Poker Tour's coverage of the Season 17 WPT Gardens main event. We're here at the Gardens Casino in Southern California and play is wrapped up on day three for another action-packed day of poker. Just 46 players remain from the 584 entries that started and all are well in the money and guaranteed $12,800. Leading the way is Saya Ono with $2.114 in chips, good for almost double that of the next closest competitor. Ono is a California poker player with nearly $200,000 in live tournament earnings. She's making her third WPT main tour cash in hopes of reaching her first final table. One of the hands that helped propel Ono to the lead came when she knocked out Ari Angle in 55th place. Angle 4-bet jammed on Ono with pocket 7s, but Ono held two aces and made the quick call. Her aces held from there to send one of the tournament's most experienced players to the rail. Ono was also the player to burst the money bubble when she sent WPT champion and former player of the year Matt Salzberg home in 74th place. Ono isn't the only woman remaining in the field, as last season's WPT Bobby Baldwin Classic runner-up Kitty Quo is also still alive. She ended the day with 590,000 in chips. Joining Ono and Quo in advancing to day four are WPT Champions Club members Ryan Tosuk with 940,000, Mike Del Vecchio with 623,000, and Marvin Rettenmeyer with 575,000. WPT Garden's satellite winners Jin Hao Han and Samir Aljanidi will both be continuing their impressive runs when play resumes on Wednesday. Han finished with 598,000, while Aljanidi bagged 344,000. The brotherly duo of Aaron and Ralph Massey are also still ticking. Day four of the WPT Gardens main event kicks off at noon on Wednesday at the Gardens Casino, and the plan is to play down to the final table of six has been reached. With $565,000 and a brand new Mercedes-Benz up top for the winner, this is an event you don't want to miss. Stay tuned to WPT.com for more coverage from the World Poker Tour.